My experiences with teaching video production people uh, have been almost universally positive. It's really exciting to watch people come into a situation where they've consumed a huge amount of media but haven't really unlocked the box to figure out how to do it themselves. Well, I work with quite a few varieties of students here at Webster University and I think a couple of things come to mind about how I work with individual students. I try to see what their interests are and also what their skill sets are and what they hope to do in the future when they get out of Webster. We have tried to make the facilities as closely match the real world conditions that people will find when they get out of here as we possibly can. I think at Webster University we've had a lot of good support from the administration to purchase equipment and keep up to date with new technologies as they emerge. So for example, we now have high definition cameras. Um, I think it's great in the video program that you get to learn Avid, Final Cut Pro, as well as all the other courses and software. I came into Webster thinking that I knew a lot about audio. Um, I'd recorded a lot of bands in high school. I was kind of the go-to guy for uh, recording music and I really liked doing it. And then I came to Webster and uh, I didn't know how to use a console. You know, I didn't know uh, mic selection. The lighting, the miking, the dollies we work with, the cameras. We also learn how to work on Avid and we have to edit our projects and work with the sound and make sure everything's perfect. Oh, I take a few audio classes, mostly music classes. The facilities are great. I use the practice rooms every day. Um, I use the studios, the amplifiers that are provided. Uh, I feel that I'm really taken care of here. Now, of course, there's always going to be budgetary limitations. And one of the things that comes up a lot is the fact that our students are extraordinarily expensive to educate. You know, you think about an English major. Well, they don't really need all these expensive cameras and microphones and all the things that we have to buy. Uh, that being said, even with a few budgetary limitations, I think that we do a great job. You know, our studio is has uh, up-to-the-date lighting facilities. We have pretty heavily invested in high-definition technology, even at the highest end. We've started to create a workflow in our editing labs that as closely mimics the real world as we can. Um, and we've got a lot of big plans for the future as to how to bring those things even more in line. After graduating Webster, I am honestly thinking about moving out to L.A. I feel that I'm prepared. I feel that um, my teachers are doing a great job with my education. I think that Webster does set you up to get hired. The best part about this job is to make people who have these dreams give them the tools to make those dreams come true and it happens over and over and over again and you watch people go from sort of wide-eyed and uh, amazed by every step of the process to proficient to mastery to where they're actually teaching other people and you know that you've given them a tool set that's going to let them go out and do something every day that is pretty much synonymous with making magic happen so pretty good gig if you can get it. Yeah.